Okay, so in this uh, session we are going to uh, see different addressing modes and how they work. So let's say we want to um, look at all the different addressing modes starting with uh, the direct addressing mode. So basically we have in the data segment within the data segment we have some variables and arrays like variable uh, one is of type byte. It has this element. Then we have array one of type word, which has these elements. Similarly, we have another array by the name of array two, which is of type double word, and it has the elements. And remember that uh, assembly language is not case sensitive, so you can write in any case that you want or you can mi mix the two. So now our code segment begins in our main procedure. So now basically <coughs> uh, direct addressing scheme is when we use the name of the array or variable to access the value of uh, the array or variable. So for example if you have move al comma variable 1 then this is an example of uh, direct addressing and this will move the value of variable 1 inside al so al will become 10 hexadecimal after this instruction and we can also check it using the call dump register instruction or the dump register function. Now also keep in mind that we can also add an offset to the name of the variable or array and we can for example write variable 1 plus 1 and this will not give us an error even though variable 1 is not an array but a variable and it will go to the next byte in the memory and it will pick up this from RAM and move it to AL because variable 1 plus 1 takes it to the next memory location where this is stored, the least significant byte of the first element of array 1. So after the instruction, AL would become uh, 0, 01 hexadecimal, which is the least significant byte of array 1's first element. We can also check this using the dump register function like this. So now we can save the file. We have to select all files. Let's uh, say we call it addressing or ad mode one dot asm. So we save it. Then we go to the DOS prompt. So this is what we get. We go to the required folder and we assemble our file which was ad mode or ad mode one dot asm. So it has been assembled without any errors. Now we run it and we get a display of these values. So now if we bring this up we can see that after the first instruction inside AL we have the value 10 hexadecimal and remember that the least significant uh, 8 bits are represented by these two digits. So this is AL, the next two digits are AH and these are the upper 16 bits of EX. Similarly variable 1 plus 1 moves the value 0 1 hexadecimal which is the least significant byte of the first element of array 1. 